Discord is a popular communication platform for gamers, businesses, and communities. And with its ease-to-use interface and powerful features, it has become an essential tool for many people around the world. However, not all users on Discord play by the rules. Some try to gain an unfair advantage by using automated user accounts, also known as self-bots. Now, just before I move into self-bots, I do want to let you know that Discord bots are different from self-bots. Discord bots are an integral part of the platform. They are automated programs that can perform various tasks such as moderating chat, playing music, or providing information. And bots can actually be a valuable addition to any server, and many communities rely on them to function smoothly. As for the self-bots, they're different from Discord bots because they operate from a user account rather than a bot account, and they can mimic human action on Discord such as sending messages, reacting to messages, joining voice channels, and more. Now, self-bots are very disruptive to a server's community because they can flood chat channels with messages, making it difficult for users to have a conversation. And they can also spam voice channels with noises, making it impossible to communicate effectively. Fortunately, Discord has taken steps to combat the use of self-bots, and the platform's terms of services explicitly prohibits the use of automation for user accounts anyway. And its developers have implemented measures to detect and ban self-bots. So if you ever suspect that someone is using a self-bot on your server, I would recommend to report them to Discord support team because hopefully they will investigate and take appropriate action. I also want to add that in contrast, Discord bots are designed to operate within the rules and guidelines set by Discord. So they are created using bot accounts, which have their own set of permissions and limitations. And bots can actually enhance the user experience on Discord by providing useful functionality without disrupting the community. So in conclusion, self-bots are a serious issue on Discord, while Discord bots are an essential part of the platform. And to be honest, it's up to all of us to be vigilant and report any suspicious activity. Discord can't really do anything alone by itself. They do try their best to keep the platform clean and peaceful, but we can help keep Discord a safe and enjoyable platform for everyone. Anyways, just a short description on self-bots and difference between Discord bots and self-bots. I hope that was helpful. See you in the upcoming video. Peace out.